Who doesn't love this time of year for homesteading? I mean, it's 3.30 and it's almost dark. You want to get some more projects done, but it's cold and miserable and raining and muddy and dark. It's just yucky. One of the big projects we actually just got done yesterday, though, is we harvested one of our Highland cows. We're going to put out a video soon on that. Basically, Bridget and I talk about the whole process, um, how we feel about it, how we deal with it, what happens during different stages of it, that sort of thing. Um, kind of get give you an in-depth look at harvesting your own animals, ones you've named, ones you've looked after. So that's going to come up soon in another video. The pigs have all been harvested as well, so we've got them stored away in the freezer. We also canned a bunch of it. Uh, so we're really happy about that. We got two put away for us. One of the big projects that we did get done that we're really happy about this year too as well is we cleared a whole section of woods right here. We went back, I'd say an easy 100 feet away from the house. We had a forest fire earlier in the spring that really concerned us. So I want to make sure the house and all the animals are kind of protected. So we pushed the forest back a bit. This will give us some more garden and sunlight space as well. The gardens did pretty well this year. We harvested a ton of carrots, which is great. So we've got some canned, we've got some in the freezer, we've got different forms put away to use next year and or this coming year in recipes and with dinner and that sort of thing. So you know how stuff always happens at the homestead and it just causes you more work and problems. So when I was right over here talking about the gardens and the carrots, I kind of glanced out of the corner of my eye we now have a big tree across one of our paths that we snowmobile on and walk on. So somehow in the next little while when I'm busy with work and busy trying to get other stuff winterized, now I got a tree to get out of the way. Shouldn't be too bad, it just another extra project, right? So as we start getting everything winterized and put away, we did actually have a harvest in the greenhouse of salad. So we had a salad this week from the greenhouse we're still actually pulling out some Amish paste, Amish paste tomatoes from the greenhouse as well. And as we get everything kind of wrapped up for winter, we're kind of moving projects inside as well. So Bridget's actually been spending a bunch of time too down in the basement, not only weaving, but coming up with some new creations. So she's now making toques and the toques looked pretty awesome different designs made out of wool. They're gonna be really warm in the winter. So if you want a unique toque, let us know because we're gonna have some available soon. So we'll keep you posted on that as well. So guys, I'm gonna go close up the garage, get some more little chores done, go in, grab some dinner, and start the long winter hibernation. We'll talk to you soon in the next video. Love ya.